With the economy slowly recovering from a devastating recession, the new year brings the possibility of a new career. NCTV 17's Jordan Abudea takes a look at the top jobs of 2013. Unlucky 13 might not be so unlucky if you can score a job in the tech field, finance industry, or marketing. Chicago-based CareerBuilder.com looked at the fields with growing demand and determined what would be the best fields to enter this year. We look at the number of jobs posted on our site, and then we look at the number of jobs that have increased on the site um, over the years. We also look at um, uh, EMSI, which is um, a division of CareerBuilder, and they look at all the economic data from the government as well as the private sector, and then we come up with different lists on um, top jobs and what we expect to see in the future. And here's what they found. The demand for IT professionals is as high as 48 percent. Software developers have a median salary of $90,000 a year and a projected growth rate of 30 percent. Jeff Denard is the director of career development at North Central College, where he works with students as they transition into the workforce. We've seen some growth in interest in, in the technology side. We, the majors we've had uh, added lately, the interactive media studies, the graphic design, there's a higher demand for that. With baby boomers heading towards retirement, there's a higher demand for financial advisors. And in the aftermath of a global financial meltdown, companies are looking for accountants and auditors who can navigate the new federal regulations. Those jobs are expected to grow by as much as 41%. If you want to work with numbers in a different way, social media has flooded the markets with new data. Companies are now looking for marketing analysts and specialists. Jobs in those fields are expected to grow by 41 percent. Social networking, social media is important. And so being able and willing to sort of jump in and, um, and swim around in it a little bit and get comfortable, I think is, is pretty helpful. But there will be plenty of competition. What employers are looking for is somebody who is going to stand out. And how do you stand out? It's really show um, what impact you had on the bottom line in your last job. And, and you really have to show them what you're going to do in the future. The key trait all of the experts agreed on is that workers need to have flexibility to adapt to a changing workforce. I'm Jordan Abadea reporting for Naperville News 17. Jobs in production-related fields and health care are also anticipated to continue growing.